This one has multi-generational living written all over it. Come see what I mean. There's just some things that photos can't show you and that's what I want to do today when we're going through this home together and a perfect example of that would be this tall ceilings when you first walk into the home you can see all the way to the where the loft area is but more importantly some of the stuff that you're gonna see in this particular home are high-end features and upgrades that you typically don't get and it's gonna be a very consistent theme that you see as we continue walking through this home together. Now, this particular kitchen, it was upgraded. The seller decided to use the gourmet kitchen package with the builder. This one in particular, the builder was MI Homes, who has a higher reputation in the Wesley Chapel community. They're known for their quality of work and giving people options. And for example, as we're moving through this kitchen, you're going to notice the sleek granite countertops and those stylish pendant lights. It just gives it that very simple look and just absolutely gorgeous. You got the electric stovetop oven there. And one of the cool things that I really like about this house is that you got that butler's pantry with all that cabinet space in a see-through pantry uh, for all the food. I didn't want to walk in there for too much because that's pretty much the seller's business as to what they eat and what they don't eat. Uh, and then if you look ahead, you're actually going to see this versatile flex room. At this time, the seller is actually using it as a home office. Uh, and you see those upgraded French doors that uh, the seller decided to install. But essentially, if you don't have an office and you don't want to put it in the front of the house, you can actually use it as like a, maybe a playroom or even a, a library type of spacing. Moving through the dining room area, you're gonna see that this is a very expansive type of floor plan with lots of space for entertaining and just for bringing your guests over. If you notice how big that couch is, right? You can imagine how many people you can actually sit in that area, whether you're watching a movie or maybe football games on a Sunday, this is just the perfect space for it. And one of the things that I wanted you to really pay attention to and be patient with is this additional room that we're going to check out together. I can't tell you how many times that I've had a lot of clients of mine and request people who make those requests online, look for a space that's separate from all the other bedrooms so that they can eventually put someone like a child, a teenager, maybe a parent, or just utilize this space as a guest room. Um, if you don't live in Florida, one of the things that you find out that when you do live here, you have everyone who wants to come and visit you out of state because friends and family, they don't want to pay for a hotel. So they rather stay in your house. And that is an absolute perfect space for it. We're going to head upstairs here in a second, but let me go ahead and take this time to introduce myself. My name's Jose Mejia. I'm a real estate agent in the Tampa Bay area. And I actually live in Wesley Chapel. I've uh, been here for the past uh, 15 years and we absolutely love it. And when I mean we, I mean myself, my wife and my daughter. Uh, this is a place that we've seen grow and it's one of those popular areas that most people want to move into. We actually ended up helping the seller when they first bought this home from MI Homes uh, just because we knew a lot of the builders that we typically work with, we knew MI Homes was the perfect builder for this particular person. Since then, though, they've been actually shutting down the community because they pretty much sold out. 
They probably have one or two options remaining at the time of this video. Going into this owner suite, you notice how huge it is. And those tray ceilings, it just give that bedroom like a sophisticated look and you get a lot of natural daylight. Honestly, guys, that bed right there is a king size bed. Even if you have something bigger, you're not gonna have any trouble putting stuff in that bedroom because it's huge. Got the tub and you got that shower uh, with those beautiful matte finishes and that shower head from the ceiling. That was an upgraded feature that the seller decided to add because it just gives that area a nice, elegant look. If you're curious about the measurements of this particular room, it's somewhere between 15 and a half and by 21 feet, if that gives you an idea of how spacious it is. But let's continue uh, going into the third bedroom of this video. Um, this is an additional bedroom that they're using. Uh, this is, they're actually expecting here pretty soon. So if you notice, you got the little, uh, little baby carriage there, if you want to call it that. I'm not sure if that's the actual correct name or not. You got that beautiful wall that they just recently updated. Uh, it just gives that room a little bit of character. And we got the bathroom that is shared between the three other rooms that are upstairs. So uh, just to kind of recap, upstairs we got four bedrooms. One of them is the owner suite that we just walked through. And the other three bedrooms um, on the second floor all, show, uh, all will share that particular bathroom. This loft area, again, lots of daylight coming in. If you notice the wall, the white wall right there with the trim, nice, elegant, and simple look. It's just absolutely stunning. If you ever walk into this home, you're gonna see what I'm talking about. We do have a lot of carpeted on this particular second floor. A lot of it is because this particular family has kids, and I think we all know how kids are. They love to roll around the floor and play fighting games and uh, what better way to protect uh, your knees by having some nice plush carpet like what you find in this particular home. You're looking at one of the last bedrooms um, that we're going to be peeking at and we'll have another one here pretty soon uh, once we leave here. But all these bedroom guys are super spacious um, and they have, all have real room in the closets if you're wondering about the size of the closets. Um, I didn't want to take a video of that because some people actually want to see the closet size and there's just some that don't care for it. But if you do want to know how spacious it is, just let me know and I'll be more than happy to send you a message with clips of that actual closet. Just make sure you specify what room you want to go see in terms of the closet size. So there you have it. You got over 3,500 square feet of property here that we just walked through. One of the things that we didn't catch here is a extended patio that's screened in. That's something you're gonna to wanna to check out as well. If you feel like this home is too big, make sure you stick around. You're gonna see two other properties that come up on your screen. They're a little bit smaller, but just as beautiful. <laughs> 